the mystery of the forgotten temple in Rome. Chapter 1. The Archaeological Clue The year was 1949, and Rome, the eternal city, cradled within its ancient walls the secrets of centuries past. For Isabella Turner, an archaeologist with a passion for unraveling the mysteries of antiquity, this city held a promise of discovery and untold histories waiting to be unearthed. Little did she know that a single cryptic clue would set in motion an adventure that would lead her to the heart of a forgotten ancient temple. It all began in the quiet halls of a dusty archive tucked away in a corner of Rome. Isabella, with her keen eyes and an insatiable curiosity, delved into ancient manuscripts and scrolls, seeking fragments of information that could shed light on hidden treasures. It was during one such meticulous exploration that she stumbled upon a cryptic clue, a snippet of text that hinted at the existence of a temple lost to time. The clue spoke of forgotten chambers, concealed beneath the layers of history, and the whispers of a temple's existence echoed through the ancient words. Isabella's heart quickened with excitement as she deciphered the enigmatic message, realizing that this discovery could rewrite the narrative of Rome's past. The Eternal City, known for its iconic landmarks, harbored a secret waiting to be unveiled. The journey began in the heart of Rome, where the cobblestone streets resonated with the footsteps of countless generations. The Colosseum loomed in the background, a silent witness to the ebb and flow of history. Armed with the cryptic clue, Isabella embarked on a quest that would take her through narrow alleys, hidden corners, and the ruins of temples long forgotten. Her first destination was the Roman Forum, an ancient marketplace and the political center of ancient Rome. As Isabella traversed the worn paths, she marveled at the towering columns of the Temple of Saturn and the remnants of the Basilica Julia. The clue ended at the intersection of history and mythology, guiding her steps toward the heart of the archaeological site. Amidst the ruins, Isabella discovered symbols etched into weathered stones, each telling a story of a bygone era. The cryptic clue led her to a concealed entrance, a passageway that seemed to beckon her into the depths of the city's secrets. With a mixture of anticipation and trepidation, she descended into the subterranean labyrinth that would become the starting point of her quest. Navigating through the underground passages, Isabella encountered remnants of a time long past. The air carried the scent of ancient dust, and the flickering light of her lantern illuminated faded frescoes on the walls. Symbols, intricately carved into the stones, guided her like a trail of breadcrumbs. The city beneath the city became a silent witness to her journey, unfolding its layers like the pages of a forgotten manuscript. The cryptic messages led her to hidden chambers adorned with artifacts that hinted at the temple's purpose. Isabella's train had discerned the significance of each discovery, ceremonial vessels, fragments of intricate pottery, and symbols that spoke of rituals conducted in reverence to forgotten deities. The archaeological puzzle began to take shape, and the temple, shrouded in the mysteries of time, beckoned her forward. As Isabella emerged from the underground passages, she found herself at a forgotten corner of Rome, far from the bustling tourist trails. The cryptic clue had led her to a concealed enclave, where a small temple stood, its grandeur muted by the passage of centuries. Ivy clung to the weathered stones, and the temple's entrance seemed to invite her into the sanctum of a forgotten era. With a deep breath, Isabella crossed the threshold, stepping into the hallowed space of the ancient temple. The air within resonated with the energy of centuries, and the walls seemed to whisper tales of devotion and rituals long abandoned. Isabella, 
surrounded by the echoes of history, stood at the precipice of an archaeological revelation that promised to rewrite the narrative of Rome's ancient past. Isabella Turner, the intrepid archaeologist, stood before the forgotten temple, ready to unravel the secrets concealed within its sacred walls. The cryptic clue had been the key to unlocking a mystery that transcended time, and with each step, Isabella ventured further into the heart of an adventure that would reshape the narrative of Rome's enduring history. Chapter 2 The Trail of Cryptic Messages Isabella Turner stood on the threshold of the Forgotten Temple, the echoes of history reverberating through the air. The cryptic clue, discovered in the depths of Rome's underground, had led her to this sacred space, where the walls seemed to hold secrets that begged to be unveiled. The journey, reminiscent of a detective's pursuit, unfolded through the storied streets of Rome, each cobblestone bearing witness to the footsteps of countless generations. With the threshold crossed, Isabella found herself surrounded by the remnants of a once sacred sanctuary. The interior of the temple, but weathered by time, exuded an aura of reverence. Faint light filtered through openings in the ceiling, casting a soft glow on the ancient symbols that adorned the walls. It was here, within the confines of the forgotten temple, that Isabella's journey would enter its next phase. The cryptic messages, embedded in the carvings and symbols, guided Isabella through the temple's chambers. She traced the intricacies of each mark, piecing together the narrative they wove. The messages seemed to communicate the rituals performed within these sacred walls, the beliefs that once echoed through the hallowed space. Isabella, with a sense of awe, recognized the interconnectedness of the symbols, forming a language that transcended the boundaries of time. As she ventured deeper into the temple, Isabella discovered hidden alcoves and chambers adorned with relics of a bygone era. The cryptic messages, once abstract, now took on tangible forms through ancient artifacts, ceremonial masks, engraved tablets, and offerings that spoke of devotion to deities long forgotten. Each discovery added layers to the tapestry of the temple's history, painting a vivid picture of the rituals and ceremonies that unfolded within its sacred confines. The trail of cryptic messages extended beyond the temple's walls, leading Isabella through the labyrinthine streets of Rome. The Colosseum loomed in the distance, a silent sentinel to her quest. The clues pointed to specific locations, each unveiling a fragment of the temple's story. Isabella, undeterred by the challenges, became a modern-day detective, following the breadcrumbs of history through the iconic landmarks and hidden corners of the Eternal City. In the Roman Forum, where the ancient voices seemed to echo through the ruins, Isabella deciphered symbols etched into the stones. The clues hinted at the interconnectedness of the forgotten temple with other sacred sites across Rome. The Pantheon, with its iconic dome, and the Temple of Vesta, guardian of the eternal flame, became waypoints in Isabella's journey. The cryptic messages, now part of a larger tapestry, formed a narrative that transcended individual structures, weaving a tale of shared rituals and beliefs. Isabella's pursuit took her to the Capitoline Hill, where the remnants of the Temple of Jupiter Optimus Maximus stood as a testament to Rome's grandeur. The cryptic messages, now more intricate and layered, revealed the temple's significance in the broader context of ancient Roman spirituality. Isabella, with a sense of reverence, traced the symbols and inscriptions that connected the forgotten temple to the very heart of Rome's religious life. The journey led her through narrow alleys and hidden courtyards, where symbols on the walls spoke of secret societies and ancient alliances. 
The cryptic messages, once confined to the temple, now unfolded as a citywide narrative, a tapestry of history waiting to be deciphered. Isabella, with each revelation, felt a kinship with the detectives of literature, Agatha Christie's Hercule Poirot and Arthur Conan Doyle's Sherlock Holmes, as she navigated the intricate plot woven into the fabric of Rome. As Isabella continued to follow the trail, she encountered a network of symbols etched into the architecture of churches and monuments. The clues hinted at a hidden language, a legacy passed down through generations, connecting the forgotten temple to a lineage of secret keepers. Isabella, with a detective's intuition, saw out those who held the key to this enigmatic language, uncovering a community that guarded the ancient wisdom encoded within the city's structures. Isabella deciphered a particularly complex set of symbols within the catacombs beneath Rome. The cryptic messages converged to unveil a revelation, a map that outlined the location of a hidden chamber beneath the city, a chamber that held the final pieces of the Forgotten Temple's puzzle. With the weight of anticipation, Isabella prepared to descend into the subterranean depths, where the mysteries of the ancient sanctuary awaited their ultimate revelation. Chapter 3 Unveiling Hidden Chambers Isabella Turner stood on the precipice of a revelation, the cryptic messages echoing through her mind as she prepared to descend into the subterranean depths beneath Rome. The map, a culmination of her detective work, pointed to a hidden chamber that held the final pieces of the forgotten temple's puzzle. The journey, akin to the adventurous spirit of Indiana Jones, unfolded through the labyrinthine catacombs, each step bringing her closer to the heart of the enigma. As Isabella navigated the dimly lit passages, the air thick with the scent of ancient earth, she marveled at the hidden world beneath the city. The cryptic messages, now imprinted on her consciousness, seemed to guide her with an ethereal presence. The echoes of footsteps, both ancient and modern, resonated through the catacombs as she approached a concealed entrance, a portal to the hidden chamber that held the culmination of her quest. The chamber, when revealed, exceeded Isabella's expectations. Ancient symbols adorned the walls, glowing faintly in the soft light of her lantern. The atmosphere within vibrated with an otherworldly energy, as if the chamber itself held the secrets of a bygone era. Isabella, with a sense of reverence, studied the symbols, realizing that they formed a celestial map that connected the forgotten temple to the cosmic forces revered by ancient civilizations. The hidden chamber revealed artifacts and relics, carefully arranged in patterns that mirrored the constellations above. Isabella's archaeological instincts kicked in as she deciphered the significance of each element, celestial alignments, sacred geometry, and astronomical calculations. The cryptic messages, once scattered fragments, now coalesced into a narrative that transcended the boundaries of earthly history. The symbols took Isabella to the center of the room, to an old shrine that appeared to be the location where all of the cosmic energies came together. She had a feeling that the secrets of the abandoned temple could be revealed through this hallowed place. A rush of energy shot through her as she touched the worn stone, evoking the old customs carried out in homage to vanished gods. Isabella's exploration of the hidden chamber revealed a series of murals that depicted the forgotten temple in its prime. Scenes of ceremonies, conducted by priests adorned in elaborate garments, unfolded before her eyes. The cryptic messages, now translated into visual narratives, portrayed a connection between the earthly and the celestial, where the rituals within the temple were harmoniously aligned with the cosmic forces. 
As Isabella delved deeper into the chamber's secrets, she uncovered a series of ancient texts that provided insights into the spiritual practices of the temple's custodians. The writings spoke of a lineage of guardians who, through the generations, had preserved the sanctity of the forgotten temple. Isabella, in the spirit of a detective uncovering a hidden history, traced the ancestral threads that connected these guardians to the very fabric of Rome's spiritual tapestry. The cryptic messages, now imprinted on scrolls and manuscripts, detailed the rituals of initiation and the responsibilities bestowed upon the guardians. Isabella, with a scholar's diligence, pieced together the ancient traditions that had been passed down through generations. The Forgotten Temple, it seemed, held a sacred role in preserving the delicate balance between the earthly and the divine. The trail of messages led Isabella to an underground chamber, an archive of scrolls and manuscripts that chronicled the temple's history. As she carefully perused the texts, she discovered references to an ancient artifact, a relic imbued with cosmic energies that had once been at the center of the temple's rituals. The cryptic messages, now intertwined with the artifact's history, pointed to a location where the sacred object might still be concealed. Armed with newfound knowledge, Isabella emerged from the hidden chamber with a sense of purpose. The cryptic messages, once mere symbols etched into stone, had transformed into a narrative that connected the forgotten temple to the celestial realms. The relic, a conduit for cosmic energies, became the focal point of her quest. Isabella, with the determination of a detective closing in on a crucial clue, prepared to embark on the final phase of her adventure, the search for the ancient artifact that would complete the puzzle of the Forgotten Temple. Chapter 4 The Rediscovery of an Ancient Temple Isabella Turner emerged from the hidden chamber beneath Rome, her mind buzzing with the revelations of the cryptic messages and the cosmic energies that seemed to infuse the very air. The ancient artifact, a relic of immense significance, beckoned her to uncover the final piece of the puzzle that had led her through the labyrinth of the Eternal City. The rediscovery of the Forgotten Temple stood at the threshold, and Isabella, with a sense of anticipation, embarked on the culmination of her adventure. The cryptic messages, imprinted in her mind like an indelible map, guided Isabella to the outskirts of Rome. The clues hinted at a location where the ancient artifact might still be concealed, awaiting its rediscovery. As she traversed the city's edges, the urban landscape gradually gave way to a serene countryside where remnants of a forgotten era lay hidden beneath the foliage. Isabella arrived at a secluded grove, its tranquility contrasting with the bustling energy of Rome. The cryptic messages, now subtly integrated into the natural surroundings, guided her to a sacred clearing. The air seemed to shimmer with a mystical aura as Isabella approached the heart of the grove. Here, beneath the shade of ancient trees, she uncovered the entrance to a concealed chamber, the final destination in her quest for the forgotten temple. The chamber revealed itself as a natural grotto, adorned with symbols that mirrored the cosmic patterns depicted in the hidden chamber beneath Rome. The cryptic messages, seamlessly integrated into the gross surroundings, formed a celestial tapestry that connected the earthly realm to the cosmic forces above. Isabella, with a sense of awe, realized that she stood on the threshold of a space where the ancient artifact awaited its rediscovery. The relic, according to the ancient texts, was a conduit for cosmic energies, a bridge between the earthly and the divine. Isabella's hands trembled with anticipation as she uncovered the artifact, a beautifully crafted object adorned with symbols that mirrored the constellations. The cryptic messages, 
now culminating in the discovery of the sacred relic, seemed to resonate with an energy that transcended time. As Isabella held the artifact, a surge of energy coursed through her, connecting her to the cosmic forces that had once fueled the rituals of the Forgotten Temple. The relic, it seemed, recognized her as a custodian of its ancient wisdom, and Isabella felt a profound sense of responsibility to ensure its preservation. The rediscovery of the Forgotten Temple, now complete with the retrieval of the sacred artifact, marked a moment of triumph and reverence. The grove, bathed in a soft glow, became a sanctuary where Isabella communed with the artifact's energies. The cryptic messages, once scattered fragments, now converged into a harmonious symphony that resonated with the natural surroundings. Isabella, in the spirit of a guardian entrusted with ancient knowledge, realized that the rediscovery of the Forgotten Temple was not merely a personal triumph, but a connection to a legacy that spanned centuries. As Isabella exited the grove, she carried the artifact with a sense of purpose. The cryptic messages, now etched into her understanding, pointed to a concluding ritual that would seal the rediscovery of the Forgotten Temple. The journey, a blend of detective work and archaeological exploration had transformed Isabella into a conduit for the ancient wisdom that pulsed through the relic in her possession. Returning to the heart of Rome, Isabella found herself standing once again before the Forgotten Temple. The relic, now an integral part of her quest, seemed to resonate with the sacred space. The cryptic messages, translated into a language of symbols and energies, guided her through a ceremonial ritual that echoed the ancient practices of the temple's custodians. As Isabella performed the ritual, the Forgotten Temple underwent a transformation. The celestial symbols glowed with an ethereal light, and the air seemed to vibrate with the energies that pulsed through the relic. The cryptic messages, now elevated to a cosmic language, formed a connection between the earthly and the divine, and the temple's purpose, long dormant, awakened with a renewed vitality. The rediscovery of the Forgotten Temple, with its sacred relic at the center, marked the end of Isabella Turner's extraordinary adventure. The cryptic messages, once a trail of clues, had led her through the heart of Rome into hidden chambers and sacred groves, ultimately unveiling the cosmic connection between the Forgotten Temple and the celestial forces that governed the universe. As Isabella stood before the transformed temple, the relic in her hands radiating with ancient energies, she felt a profound sense of fulfillment. The rediscovery of the forgotten temple became not just a personal triumph, but a testament to the enduring connection between humanity, history, and the mysteries that lie hidden beneath the surface of the eternal city. Please watch the other videos from our playlists. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel to keep updated with new captivating mysteries.